What's going on guys? It's Cameron from CamD Gaming. Today I'm going to be showing you a really easy way that you can unlock the slow and steady achievement or trophy in Call of Duty World War II really early on in the game. Actually, during the second mission, Operation Cobra. That's coming up. Alright guys, so during Operation Cobra, the second mission of the campaign, you are going to get an objective called Reach the Vantage Point. And once you get there, you're going to use your binoculars and see that there are some friendly tanks which are being harassed by German artillery crews. Now you have to take out these crews, at which point you can ask Pearson to use his binoculars to scout all the enemies in front of you. Now this is actually where you can start working on the slow and steady achievement, which is to spend three minutes using focus in the campaign. Now focus is an ability that you can use usually with scoped rifles, a sniper rifle or something like that, where you can hold your breath and in this Call of Duty game it actually sort of slows down time so you can take the perfect shot. I think you can also use this with a rifle that doesn't have a scope if you've activated Pearson's scouting ability. That being said, I recommend just grab the sniper rifle that's already available right up there at the vantage point and start taking out the German artillery crews as you can see I've been doing here. Now every time that you use the focus ability if you drain the bar completely it lasts about six seconds and remember you need to use it for three minutes total through the whole campaign. Now this is something that I think you'll unlock naturally as you progress through the different story missions but if you want to try and unlock it as soon as possible Operation Cobra is the way to do it. Once you've taken out those German artillery crews and your tanks proceed to smash through the little berm that's right there, don't actually follow them. Sort of stay back in the area that you just cleared. Now the reason for this is that you can actually look through those openings that your tanks created and as long as you don't cross over that berm yourself, there's unlimited enemy respawns, which means there's unlimited amount of time that you can use the focus ability. You also can keep asking Pearson to use his scouting binoculars ability to work towards the IC movement achievement where you have to ask him to do that 25 times. Now as far as slow and steady goes, I don't think you actually even need to be firing. In fact, there's some points when I was working on it that I didn't even have ammo for my sniper rifle, but I continued looking down the scope and obviously using the focus ability. If you stay behind the berm and you don't cross over, there is even some ammo back where the German artillery crews were firing from. You can go and scrounge some of that up there. All in all, this should take you roughly about 10 minutes to complete if you're using this technique. Once you've used the focus ability for three minutes, the achievement should unlock for you. And it's as easy as that. I hope that this guide helped you so you can unlock it really early on in the game. And if it did, give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more. As always, we'll see you in the next video.